Hey, son. Hey, hey, hey. Yeah, I know. You having a good time, aren't you? Yes, you are. Because we chilling, man. We chilling. We have the doctors. They're going to take care of you. You know what I'm saying? Everything is cool. What do they say? Say cool beans. Everything is cool beans. Everything is cool beans. He's over here laughing. I go, mommy, filling out paperwork. Oh my goodness. Yeah. Boy named Joe, girl named Ghoul, they met each other in junior high school. Ghoul moved back to Pakistan, Facebook connected them again. 17 years of separation makes for a lot of phone conversations. Joe popped the question, Ghoul said yes, they flew to Sydney, guess what's next? First came love, then came marriage, then baby Joe in the baby carriage. So, we're chilling here at the Riverwalk right now. It's pretty nice, it's a nice day. There's a lot of people out here. Got baby Joey, got Ghoul. And this is baby Joey in the house. Hey! What's up, buddy? Hey. Get the camera and smile, buddy. Yeah! 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 There he goes. We're gonna head down that way to the courtyard and we're gonna do would you rather right now it's pot belly some more we're just walking to the hour just walking walking and talking walking and talking and sightseeing thank god it's not hot man i know i'm so happy it's nice weather today. i know it could have been a lot worse i can miss out oh. hey, taking in the sights and signing hey Hey! He's, he's such a poser. Smile when he sees the camera or the phone. Baby Joey's being a little uh, poser right now. Mm -hmm. he, he doesn't want to smile for the camera. I don't know why. He doesn't like the paparazzi. <laughs> he said this is a bit too much for him. He said this is too much. <laughs> he says he's an introvert. So. I was an introvert for four months too. So. Oh, can you remember? Did you get milky all over you? Joey, can you stop? Oh, there he goes. <laughs> We're just chunky feet. Uh-oh, clothes change. We gotta change this little guy. Look at him, baby Joe. We got a streaker. Oh, we got a streaker. Uh-oh, somebody called the police. We got a streaker on our hands. His name is Baby Joey. His alias is Jumping Joe Jr. <laughs> His little tag is out. There you go, buddy. My chunky. It's a nice evening out here in downtown. As always, I got to point out the Alamo. There goes the Alamo right there. Bam. Which is awesome. Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Joe Thomas from Javed Thomas Times. And this is Cool Javed. And this is Would You Rather. I'm going to go first. Would you rather win a million dollars in the lottery or and never have to pay... No, wait. Would you rather win a million dollars in the lottery or never have to pay for anything else in your life? Are you asking me? Mm -hmm. Isn't that the same thing? Kind of. Pretty much it. Yeah. yeah. So I guess never have to pay for anything in my whole life. I think that'd be better because if you yeah. win a million dollars, then you can run out of a million yeah. dollars. But I didn't think of it that way. <laughs> 
Would you rather fly all over the world with your favorite celebrity or be marooned on an island with the one you love? You, you are a celebrity. You're a celebrity of Javed Thomas Times, so I'd like to fly over the world, all over the world with you and sneak and stay in Sydney. Yeah. Smile out, smile out. <laughs> okay. All right, would you rather become a popular celebrity who everybody hates or be a normal person who everybody loves? Be a normal person who everybody loves, of course. Yeah, that's a given. Any that's day. All right, all right, all right, all right. Would you rather go about your normal day naked? <laughs> <laughs> uh oh, I'm getting some trouble on this one. Oh yeah, smelly breath and body odor for the whole day. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> I'd like to smell good, but I don't want to be in public naked. Wait a minute, am I am I in public or am I at home? Would you rather go about your normal day naked? Your normal My normal day. day. That way. <laughs> I'd probably have to go with the body odor and smelling really real good. bad, man. Let me see. What else? What was it? Go about to normally naked or have smelly breath and body odor. For I'd have day. smelly breath and body odor for the whole day, like all day. I'm not going any. I'm not going there naked. <laughs> now. Would you rather be bitten by a radioactive spider or a vampire? Neither. <laughs> I think, I don't know, radioactive spider? That's deadly. Vampire is deadly too. Don't you become a vampire to get bit by one? Yeah, but vampires are cool. Vampires don't die. Okay, what do we have here? We have a little baby coming up. Oh, no, thank you. Thank you, though. I like your baby. Thank you. <laughs> How cute. <laughs> oh. Little baby Joey just got a compliment. That was cute. <laughs> I know. So okay. What's up, baby Joey? He's blushing. You blushing already, baby Joey? You better keep your mind. Look at him. <laughs> He's smiling. You better keep your mind on the books. Look at him. Like, yeah, gotta love she's, me. She's too old for you. She's too old for you, man. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that. Radioactive spider. I don't know. It's either of us. <laughs> you gotta pick one. Radioactive spider. Okay, okay. Okay. Would you rather kiss a jellyfish or step on a crab? Whoa. I'd have to say I'd rather... Man. Because I'm thinking, if I'm wondering which one I can do and still go to work on Monday with. Uh, probably step on the crab because I can go to work on some crutches. But if I kiss a jellyfish, I can't talk. I can't do nothing. No, but if he kiss on top of his head, does he still... Get yeah, and then, then somebody got to pee on it to get it off. I'm not, no. Uh, on, on your lips? Yeah. <laughs> I'm not about to have ghoul cool pee on my lips for no damn jellyfish. Okay, you got to pee. All right. Um, would you rather have a beautiful house in an ugly car or an ugly house in a beautiful car? Beautiful house and an ugly car. Beautiful house and ugly car? Okay. Me too. Now, this is for you, or it's for me. Would you rather be invisible or be able to read minds? I would want to be able to read minds because being invisible wouldn't even matter. I can conquer the world just by being able to read minds. But if you're invisible, you can go and see what people are talking about and planning, and then you can do the same thing. Yeah, it's like a, it's an extra step. It's an extra step. They only have to be talking. Most of them be speaking in their head. Yeah, I know. I know. I don't know, man. I would say because if I was invincible, 
I'd be all up in the White House, like, all right. But if I can read people's minds, I can know what's, what's behind everything. And sit in my bed and just read people's minds. Yeah. Okay. All right. Would you rather wake up with a different face with the same gender or a different gender with the same face? A different with the same face would look really funny. <laughs> I know it would. It would look so funny. Because I love being female, so. I might have same, to go with that one. Too. Same gender, different face. Okay. Alright. Would you get the age from the neck up only or the neck down only? <laughs> Would I rather age from the neck up only or the neck down only? <laughs> that is real funny. I would say neck down only because I could run and work out and make sure like I'm still athletic. Yeah. Okay, I would say neck up. I would say neck down. I said neck down. Yeah, yeah. Because I mean, you could work your body out. And, and make sure it doesn't get all old and stuff. And with your uh, neck up, stay looking young with a baby face for the rest of your life. You'd be like Benjamin Button. Yeah. Yeah. Um, would you rather have a droopy eye or a lisp? I have a lisp. So a lisp. I've been living with it so many years. Uh, you rock that lisp though. That lisp is not really. But dope. That's one of the first things I noticed about you. I love that. Um, Would you rather eat anything and never get fat or read people's minds? I'd rather eat anything and never get fat, man. But you would eat anything and don't get fat. You would have that. <laughs> well, I, I, I want to keep it that way. I want to have that. Yeah. I don't think I will. I'm not ready to read people's minds. You don't want to know what some people do. It would just screw up half of your head off. Yeah, the world's a crazy place. Man. Yeah. Uh, let me see. Would you rather have three wishes in ten years or one wish today? Um, I would have three wishes in ten years? Three wishes in ten years or one wish today? Three wishes in ten years, I'm greedy. Okay, okay. Oh, I'll have one wish and wish for three wishes in ten years. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> okay. Would you rather visit the world 100 years into the past or 100 years into the future? Wow. 100 years. Let me think. That'd be 1917. Man, that's a tough question. That's a good one. I would say 100. I would say one. It's all right. Be careful, you too. I would say that was a bumblebee. I would say 100 years in the future, so I can meet Jumping Joe Ford. More future. I mean, if I went back in the past, that'd be dope, though. I'd probably, uh, what, Cap Calloway? I think, nah, he was older than that. Swing in the 20s and stuff like that. But like, <laughs> Great Gatsby. Nah, that was after the next no, Man, my history sucks. Mine too. <laughs> I failed it a couple times in college. No, once. No, I got a, a D. And anyway, next. Okay. <laughs> that last one, yeah, we got to keep it PG. <laughs> but yeah, thanks for watching. Thank you. Drop a comment below to figure out, or drop a comment below to suggest any topics that uh, we should do, and then we'll do them. Yeah. All right. So that's our would you rather. I think actually, uh, in the middle of this week, we're gonna do a, <coughs> we're gonna do 40 one-liner jokes. So it's gonna be kind of dope. So uh, yeah, drop a comment. Don't maybe forget. we'll do that. Maybe we'll do it. If Bull wants to. 
but I'm thinking about doing it because these one-liners are funny, like this one. Want to hear a joke about good pizza? No, it's too cheesy. <laughs> I, well, I think it's funny. So drop a comment. Thanks for subscribing. Er, subscribe and we'll see you next Sunday at 8 p.m. Bye. Peace. Joey, you got no chill. Look at him. I uh, know.